Bitdefender is huge. It's one of the most beloved pieces of antivirus software out there and its independent testing scores are just glowing. But is it really that good? Let's do the definitive Bitdefender review and see what all the fuss is about. Now a small disclaimer here, Bitdefender has different plans and what you get highly depends on what you pick. So. Let's begin with that elephant in the room, the Bitdefender free version. I wouldn't go as far as saying that it's bad, but the experience is very bare bones. There is no additional security tools, not even ransomware protection, and it only works on one device. The best features are as usual reserved for the paid versions. Now, if you have Windows, you can choose the two cheaper plans. Bitdefender Internet, Security and Antivirus Plus. The latter actually lacks several crucial features, such as a privacy firewall to guard your webcam and microphone. So if I had to choose between these two, I'd go for internet security. However, this plan still does not have some cool features like the one-click optimizer and the anti-theft feature. Not a deal breaker at all, but it is nice to have. If you want those, you better go for the plan called Bitdefender Total Security. It works on all devices, and since I use both a MacBook and an iPhone, for me, it is an easy choice. And the price difference between this and internet security pretty much non-existent. Overall, the paid version of Bitdefender is one of the cheapest antivirus options out there. So it balances out with the shortcomings of the free version quite well. So keep in mind that this price right here is only applied with the Bitdefender coupon code. So if you use the link in the description, the whole package is super affordable. Regardless of which plan you choose, Bitdefender has one universal feature, the malware detection. A lot of independent reviewers from all kinds of outlets and organizations tested it to high heaven and gave it incredible scores. It has more awards than your average North Korean general. And if you believe those scores, barely any antivirus does a better job at stopping nasty malware from ruining your day. But you know me, I have to get my hands dirty and try everything myself. So is Bitdefender really one of the best antivirus programs as the independent testers claim? Let's find out. So here's what I did. I planted 10 randomly selected malicious files on my computer and disabled Bitdefender's real-time protection. Please do not do this at home. Then I just spun up the full scan and sat down to enjoy the fireworks. And here are the results. It took 17 minutes and a decent amount of CPU resources, but slightly less than your average antivirus. Bitdefender 2023 caught nine out of the 10 threats, although one of them did not show up as resolved. The file was still taken care of though. So. The results of the great Bitdefender versus virus brawl on my computer resulted in a crushing Bitdefender victory. Hurrah! A small note, the real-time protection would be able to catch all 10 malicious files just as they got loaded onto my hard drive, so always leave that on. Bitdefender has other useful anti-malware options too. For example, the Rescue Environment Scan, which is designed to deal with the most sophisticated kinds of malware. It basically scans your drives while windows are disabled. How cool is that? Another fancy Bitdefender feature is the vulnerability scan. It looks for weak links in your defense and recommends the ways to fix them. I highly recommend to run that from time to time, unless you are one of the security geeks who spends way too much time on hacker forums trying to keep tabs on those vulnerabilities. And of course, just as any good antivirus, Bitdefender has a lot of tools for dealing with ransomware. For one, it allows you to create backups of your most important files. It's a bit of an overkill considering that an antivirus should block ransomware even before it gets onto your computer. And if you remember my Bitdefender versus ransomware test from a while ago, it got a perfect 10 out of 10 score. But yeah, you can never be too safe, I guess. Now, the main way Bitdefender deals with ransomware and other kinds of malware is the firewall. And that's probably the most important part of any antivirus. It blocks unauthorized traffic to your computer and it alone makes Bitdefender worth it. Another one of Bitdefender's outer lines of defense is the web protection. The easiest way to get malware into your computer is by clicking some fishy links, and this feature deals with that. I tried it and it highlighted some obvious phishing websites, so that is good. It also has an anti-spam feature, and that one works great. Oh, and there are parental controls too. You can see the apps and the websites your kids use and put some limits on those. It's a great booster seat for your baby's first ventures into the internet. What else can I say? Okay, on to even more Bitdefender features. There are the system optimization tools that I found super useful. The one-click optimizer removes junk files and it works better than some dedicated junk cleaning tools. I didn't use it too much, but for once in a while use, it is great. And finally, Bitdefender does not seem content with the status of the best antivirus for 2023, so it's moved into some other fields as well. It has a VPN and a password manager, and both of them are, okay. The password manager seems decent, it's simple and reliable, although I still prefer to use a dedicated tool for that. 
The Bitdefender VPN is a whole other story. I honestly cannot recommend it. Yeah, there is a decent amount of servers from a bunch of countries, but there's only one tunneling protocol and the speed is not on par with dedicated VPNs. The basic Bitdefender plan also gives you a 200 megabyte per day cap, which is barely enough to load the intro of a Netflix episode. To remove the data limit and use the password manager, you have to get Bitdefender premium security or ultimate plans, and those are quite pricey. Still, there are some additional Bitdefender features that I found really useful. The microphone and webcam protection feature is great. If you've seen that one Black Mirror episode, you know what I mean. The file shredder feature is also quite handy. I've used it more than once to get rid of sensitive files. There are some features I didn't use that much, but you may find useful depending on what you like to do. For example, the SafePay, which is supposed to make online shopping safer, and the Wi-Fi Security Advisor. Both are convenient, but most Bitdefender antivirus reviews don't even mention them. Still, if you have Bitdefender, check them out and decide for yourself. Okay, there's something else I have to talk about. Clearly, Bitdefender has a ton of features, so how easy is it to use? It might seem counterintuitive, but for me, Bitdefender seems extremely user-friendly. The features are well categorized and thoroughly explained. Even the Bitdefender for Windows, which is the most feature rich, is easy to navigate and get the hang of. I've used Bitdefender for Mac a lot too, and while the basic features are there and the protection level is the same, many bells and whistles are gone. It is appropriately easy to use and navigate, but I kind of missed the webcam monitor and the file shredder. And of course, there is Bitdefender for iOS, which is a bit disappointing. The basic scanning function is there and it has the VPN, but that's pretty much it. And as Bitdefender evolved and got better through the years, the iOS app stayed the same, which is quite sad. Bitdefender for Android is another story. It has all the necessary functions, plus a lot of neat features, including phone-specific ones, like the anomaly detection, which scans for malicious apps. Super useful. It's time to sum up this review, but before that, consider dropping a like and subscribe, and maybe even check out our channel for more neat videos. Go on, thank you very much. Okay, the final verdict is, is Bitdefender worth it? My personal opinion is, yeah, pretty much. Top-notch security, user-friendly list, lots of features. What is there not to like? The iOS version definitely should be improved and the data limit on the VPN is just annoying. But if you can look past that, Bitdefender is definitely a top contender for the best antivirus 2023. So if you want to check it out, grab the discount in the description. Thank you so much and I will see you around.